On a recent trip to Italy, Keisha Cave, the founder of My City Kitchen, was inspired by just about everything. The people, the places, and of course, the food. Keisha is here along with one of her students, Randy McKinney. Nice to have you back. Thank Randy, you. Randy, welcome to the show. Thank you. Uh, so this was some fabulous trip, huh? Oh, my gosh. I love that place. You do? I really do. The food is phenomenal. The people are awesome, and I really enjoy going there and learning different things. Yeah. Well, you brought some pictures back with you. So oh, yeah. We're going to share them with everybody, so you can tell us what we're looking at. Oh. oh that makes me happy. <laughs> That's my friend Claudia and her husband, Antonio, and I went just to celebrate the wedding, and we just had a wonderful time. The food was incredible. Yeah, it looks and, wonderful. Oh gosh, that's polenta with a nice size of uh, beef. And we went to this uh, Chef Giancarlo's uh, restaurant and we had this wonderful pasta. Hi, Auntie. <laughs> and that's Aunt Angela and uh, Claudia's aunt. And we were just having an incredible time there. And that's on Lake now, what Como part as well. Of, where were you exactly? La uh, well, the wedding was in Cugiano in Italy. It's like uh, 20 minutes outside of Milano. And uh, the other picture with the boat was on Lake Como. Nice place to have a Didn't wedding. Didn't see George Clooney, but yeah, <laughs> saw his house. That's, That's great. great. And you picked up some tips along the way, huh? Yes, I had this incredible dish my friend Paolo made. And it was simple, really mm -hmm. simple, but the taste is phenomenal. It's fettuccine pasta, and you can uh -huh. use ravioli, any type of pasta you want. And it's just butter that's infused with sage and you cook it down for like four minutes oh, and then you fabulous. mix the pasta with the sage with fresh parmesan cheese and you drizzle with a little truffle oil. Great. All right, before we get going, yeah. Randy, I want to ask you a little bit about my city kitchen. What do you do there? I help drain... Oh, I messed up. No, no you going. didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so you're, uh, gonna, you're learning how to train the younger kids there, yes. right? You're cooking, you're doing a lot of cooking. Is there something particular you like to cook? I like to cook Italian food, but my real passion is Hispanic food. Oh, what would you say your all-time favorite is? Uh, pasta de Leos, Ooh. which are a Hispanic dish with meat and cheese inside of it, wrapped around in a nice dough. You're going to have to come back and cook that for us one yeah. day. <laughs> All right, Kisha, let's get cooking here. I see you have the linguine boiling. Yeah, so Randy, we're going to switch. Randy's going to do the cooking. Okay. And um, We're going to put you to work, Randy. All right. Of course. So Randy, like he said, you know, I'm training about five teens mm -hmm. to teach the younger kids. And Randy's been in the program for seven months. And uh, he's doing an incredible job. I love working with him. He volunteered a lot during um, the year. And I thought over the summer, why not train the, sure, the teens to cook? Sure, Share your talents, right? Yeah. So what we're doing right now is we have fettuccine pasta that's boiling. And we also have the sage butter. So Randy, you can go ahead. Um, mix the sage butter and we have this infused for about four or five minutes on okay. here and what he's going to do is take the fettuccine pasta add it to the bowl and just add a little bit of the sage butter into to it and add some fresh parmesan cheese and grate it in there mix it up and add some black Great. truffle oil. It's gonna make me lunch. I like it. <laughs> Go ahead, Randy. <laughs> now, isn't it true, Keisha, when you have homemade pasta, it takes a little less time to cook? Yes, it actually probably about two, two, it's three quick, minutes. Right? So much. Yes. So just add it all in there. Take your time and just add it in here. But what I want to also say is that um, our students will be participating in a wonderful event that is coming up um, next month. Mm -hmm. And it's with the Connecticut Stallion Tournament. And we're going to take us take our kids and have them play basketball. Oh, cool. It's going to be a 4-4, four and, four and we're going out there to win. And it's going to be an awesome time. On the 13th, we're going to have a booth at the Show Me the Funny event. And Great. it's a comedy you guys show. are always busy. Yeah, you know, we want to keep busy, keep promoting the program. And that's going to be September 13th, and that information is on our website. And for anyone that's watching, if they have any child who would be interested in cooking, mm -hmm. we do have scholarships available. Our program right. is going to start again September 3rd, I think the day after Labor Day. Okay. And we have scholarships available, so if anyone is interested, Please contact us. We'll find it on your website. Um, and you know what? I should have asked you at the beginning, sure. but tell us a little bit 
about what My City Kitchen is. Sure, sure. My City Kitchen, we are a nonprofit organization and we teach kids how to cook healthy food. We work with kids ages 6 to 17. And what we are doing now is doing a team to work program, such like Randy, we have Viani, Alex, and Christina. And they are learning how to conduct classes to teach the smaller kids ages 6 to 9 years old. Very good. Yeah. How are you doing over here, Randy? Pretty it good. smells delightful. What are you, you're going to add a little bit of the black truffle oil, a little Parmesan? Oh, yes. All right, sounds good to me. And the black truffle oil, um, you know, it, it's a it truffle, it's a mushroom, mm -hmm. and it really has a great flavor. You can smell that. Oh, I love it's it. Really I love good. anything with truffle. Oh, it's yes. going to be fantastic. All right, well, we're going to put the recipe over at WTNH.com. All I have to do is click on style. Keisha, yes. thanks so much for being here. Thanks for sharing the pictures. Oh, thank you very much. I had a wonderful time. And Randy, thanks for cooking us lunch. We're yeah. going to dig in at the end of the show. <laughs> Coming up next, we're going to tell you how New Heights is helping kids reach the top through tennis and education when style returns. We'll be right back.